Hello. Today I want to show you how one of the features of advertising system is working. Uh, there is a big advertising system that collects a lot of data and shows it to client via interface. But there is a few clients that want to get reports data through API. For this reason we, uh, we need to create token that connects to, to the team and we uh, need to share some uh, supply units uh, to these teams. Uh, all beginning in the controller that, um, that handles uh, creation and uh, viewing uh, of reports. So we uh, here we uh, use uh, for creation store function, it uses post uh, request. Here we uh, check that uh, our request is valid. Um, and yeah, validation is uh, consists of few few rules. Uh, is supply unit ID is the internal <clears throat> uh, internal ID. Uh, also, we have date from from and date two. These two dates is uh, dates that we have uh, have to use uh, for report generation. We also uh, check these dates for valid validity and that these dates should be exist. These dates should be right, um, have right pattern. Also, these dates uh, not mix it up. So, yeah, after we have uh, two web hooks uh, that we use uh, to, uh, to send the reports data <clears throat> to our clients. There is two web hooks. One of them send uh, send data uh, and second is only notifying the client that his report is generated and send some uh, report IDs to him to to get this report from our um, our API yes and um, after after we check a request, we check uh, our our user that uh, that comes to us uh, with a token. We check that this user can can handle uh, can create supply reports and can handle uh, supply unit. Uh, uh, that he that he choose to uh, to generate report after after we go to the gateway uh, I need to explain here what is gateway it is uh, gateway is the class that used uh, to collect all um, all actions that we do with the entities. Uh, for example, this uh, gateway is created for reports and um, uh, what is it doing is to uh, he can create report on, or he can post um, postpone no no he's not postponing he uh, can get this report or create or or get data or do many more things that connects with it uh, so in our case we need to to go through uh, creation here creation start with checking if this uh, report is already exists uh, it can be already in progress or done uh, so in other case we will create new report and we dispatch new job for processing our report 
uh, here uh, in this uh, uh, processing job we have several things to uh, to cover for example our report can be already in progress uh, it can stuck somehow in this uh, status or this uh, this report job can be uh, deferred uh, for example uh, this report can can have not uh, enough data uh, from our partners or from our uh, uh, reporting system so uh, and this job will failed for some reason and it will be automatically deferred uh, after we check we save the status that it's uh, this report is in progress after uh, we get report data here uh, we collect all uh, properties that we need to to get um, to get a report and send it to reporting system so this reporting system uh, will bring uh, will bring the the data that we need and we will send it to database after this uh, these steps we go to we are ready to to send a webhook uh, here we use another uh, gateway that do all job uh, that we need to to do with uh, webhooks uh, here it is this gateway uh, he can create webhook or fail uh, webhook job uh, this is also a model um, that collects uh, retry account or deferred until properties so or we can defer this uh, this job if it's failed also uh, uh, as I said previously about uh, report job here we call webhook and do some some simple things we um, understand if we need to send this webhook or no and do normal post request and save the data about this webhook so post uh, <clears throat> uh, made by Gazel um, normal uh, request so there is nothing special yeah as I said uh, we can have um, two ways to uh, to send data to our client we can uh, use webhooks or we can send him a link to uh, to our our system to our API where he, he can get the results uh, let's go back here in supply wrappers so if he get a link or uh, he can manage and don't say uh, don't put the webhook uh, URL uh, in this case he will manually uh, ask our API to to results he will use uh, report ID it is check, checked in uh, request here in report ID and also he can uh, he can um, specify format for this report there is two different types is JSON and CSV for CSV we use another thing here it's a simple thing that creates a CSV file and send it to our client uh, so yeah here it is and I think this is it
all about this feature. Um, hope you understand well what I s explained now uh, about this feature. If you have an, any questions or remarks about my job, uh, you can send me uh, in, a, in a direct messages. Thank you for watching and get well.